In today's metal stamping industry, where just-in-time manufacturing and rigid quality standard requirements are the rule, die changes of one to four hours are no longer acceptable. More frequent die changeovers are needed, and doing this with all the same old tools can drastically affect stamping press efficiency and quality. Welcome to the Wardcraft world of quick die change. Established in 1897 as McLaughlin Ward & Company Incorporated, Wardcraft serves the metal stamping industry as a major supplier of quick die change and conveyor products from our facility in Spring Arbor, Michigan. The Wardcraft quick die change philosophy is to maximize every effort in the process and preparation of die transfer to achieve optimum press efficiency. Through pre-planning, training, teamwork, and by using the Wardcraft Quick Die Change line of products, you can utilize both your press and personnel like an indie race car and pit crew to achieve optimum press efficiency and compete in the world market. There are many proven benefits of Quick Die Change. Increased press running time, improved quality and consistency, die protection, lowered parts inventories, improved personnel safety, and increased employee morale due to the teamwork involved in making it happen. Look at what these satisfied customers had to say. With the help of your QDC products and planning, it has enabled us to increase production capacity and take on new customers. Since we have converted to QDC, we have increased productivity by 41%. Adding QDC to our presses has allowed us to make shorter runs more often. The result is the 99% order fill rate we strive for. Every larger fabrication press utilized for QDC has a pair of Wardcraft T-lifts installed in it. Changeover time has been reduced from 45 to 60 minutes to 8 to 10 minutes. Along with these proven benefits, the Wardcraft system also gives stampers quiet and safe operation with low maintenance and easy operation and installation. Our Wardcraft line of products can handle any of your quick die changing needs with either the Die Glide heavy duty pneumatic die lifting system for dies up to 160,000 pounds or the T-Lift pneumatic die lifting system for dies up to 40,000 pounds. Let's look at the T-Lift systems with S-Rail attachments, half-turn mechanical die clamps, and bolster extensions. To raise the die, the air is actuated with a convenient hand valve. Note how quiet operation is as the die is lifted one-eighth of an inch above the bolster on cam rollers, inside steel rails which have been custom milled to exact T-slot dimensions for years of trouble-free operation. 1,200 pounds never moved so easy as it does out onto the swivel extension arms equipped with Wardcraft S-rails constructed of structural steel. The die has been subplated to allow for easy maneuvering and the back of the die plate has been equipped with a U-notch and a V-notch to locate the die with stop pins at the rear of the bolster. By standardizing these die subplates with locators, all the dies used on a particular press will position exactly every time. In a quick die change program, all dies used in a particular press are standardized to the same shut height, steel feed height, clamping height, and die locator positions. The result being considerable time and effort savings, which translates to increased efficiency in stamping operations. As the die is rolled back onto the press bolster, you can see how the die positioning can actually be adjusted atop the cam rollers. To achieve maximum die positioning, a four-way hand valve can raise the die on the left or right rollers as it is lowered to the bolster. Once the proper left-right position is accomplished, you can use the front to rear rollers and die positioning pins to locate the die exactly every time. The system, as you see it here, has a lift capacity of over 4,400 pounds per rail, enough to lift a four-ton die. The mechanical half-turn die clamps are equipped with heel blocks and handles, which have a clamping force of 9 tons. Without the heel block, the clamping force increases to 15 tons each on 1-inch clamps. Simply snug tighten the nuts, then tighten an extra half-turn, and they lock in place. No more concerns about stripping or breaking T-nuts or struggling with extensions on a wrench. In a quick die change program with standardized clamp heights, 
you only need to dedicate a set to the press, eliminating the need to find the proper clamps. A recent study shows that dedicated clamping will save about 10 minutes in die changeover. Based on a press time value of $300 per hour, the time saving will pay for a complete set of clamps in 25 to 30 die changes. Installation of a quick die change system is simple. Normally, a two-rail system requires about two hours to install. Simply drill holes in the proper locations as stated in the installation guide. Lay the airbag assembly in place and slide the rail over it. Install the air package and air lockout out of the way. Then attach the air lines, either the rubber or metal, whichever is compatible with the existing air supply system. The airbag assemblies are fully guarded both at the manifold and end clamp areas to protect it from scrapes and normal press removal activity. With this new design, you can expect the airbag to last two to five years, and when replacement is necessary, simply purchase the airbag material which is available by the foot. The compression style fittings allow for easy assembly and sealing. The Wardcraft Quick Die Change System. How much easier can it get? To maximize your press room efficiency, contact your local Wardcraft representative or call 1-800-782-2779 or catch us on the web 